Hello and welcome once again to the Land Rover Toolbox videos. Okay, well it's fairly straightforward to drain the oils from your transmission components, as long as you've got the tools and somewhere to drain the oil into. What the issue is for some of us is actually topping the fluids back up again. Now, I've got a tool here which is a transmission filler and it's more or less like what you'd use in a professional garage. Filling up a gearbox on this vehicle is easier than it would be on say a Discovery and using one of these to fill up a gearbox would be almost impossible. Same goes with your front and rear axles there, a little bit difficult to do with on those containers. What this is here is a pump transmission filler all right, and it's got a fairly good flow rate. This is EP80 stroke 90 oil that I'm using to fill up my differential. And for the gearbox, I'm using MTF94. Transmission filler here takes about seven and a half liters. And to buy oils on a wholesale price is much better than buying them by the liter. This 25 liter barrel of MTF94 was an investment and it's worked out quite well. It's possibly one of the most neglected things is the transmission and it does need regular oil changing depending on the service interval or what you're doing with the vehicle and like this one here I have to have a, a limited slip diff in it by Quave which I need to look after so keep it in mind if you have oil fed wheel bearings or your swivels are oil fed that you need to have the level right to make sure the bearings are being fed because these are, is a weak point if the bearings are not being fed then they will fail very quickly. Nice little deal from Paddock and it is cheaper than the leading brands of tool suppliers. So a uh, quick look at what's in the box is the uh, container and you have to assemble it. Not really a problem for guys such as ourselves and there's also assembly instructions for the less capable of us. The bonus here is you also have loads of adapters with different types of vehicles. This isn't just for Land Rovers, so the spouter adapter fitted to the handle or tap handle. Very easy to replace them, it's just a matter of undoing the union. Keep this in mind if you have a fleet of vehicles, family vehicles, stuff that you service. I'm using this one which is AF104 for servicing this Land Rover transmission unit which is an LT77 gearbox. This gives me ease of access but it's also where I can hang it. This way I'm hands free to be able to pump it from outside the vehicle or underneath the vehicle where space allows. Also comes with instructions and the adapters will tell you what vehicles you can use them on. The unit Oil flow can be switched off, which is absolutely brilliant, so it won't drip anywhere. And on the top here, you also have an engagement and a neutral position for uh, either pumping, which you can pump the fluid through. And the fluid delivery is actually quite quick. As you can see, I'm not paying attention and I put a little bit too much in the gearbox there. In the neutral position, and this is actually an important feature, is that you once you've uh, use the fluid you can then run the fluid back from the pipe back into the container now if you're going to change the oil you wouldn't need to flush the pipe so uh, easily it's a uh, less of a waste of oil and you see that the uh, hosing is already empty I can then put the fluid which is the MTF 94 back into the container leaving me to flush it out and top up with a different type of fluid okay well that's the servicing of this vehicle all the fluids have been changed and uh, filled up in ultra quick time. Well impressive tool. 